together and give God praise for the shepherd of the steel club.
No, no. You don't you know, come into some people's houses. You don't went in feeling good, feeling great, had a good time. And then by the time you got ready to go, something was lost. Because <laughs> something in their house just jumped on you. And now you taking that mess everywhere you're going. <laughs>
and he talked to his daddy. After he talked to his daddy, he said, Daddy, I need your permission. See, that's some of our problems. We move without consulting God, and we move out of time and out of season, and you're trying to figure out why stuff is torn up, because you did not go to God and ask for permission. But David said, if I'm going to do this thing the right way, God, I need your protection, and I need your clearance. And what did God tell him to do? He said, go. <laughs> I'm, talking, I'm, I'm talking to somebody here today. You've watched All right. other people get blessed. You, you've watched other people. Lord, I wish I had a good voice. You watch other people get healed. You watch other people get promoted. You watch other people ride up in a car with a brand new car. And it looks like from the natural evidence that it will never happen for you. Everyone around you is getting their joy back. Everybody around you is getting their peace back. Everybody around you is getting their happiness back. Everybody else around you things are falling into place. And you're trying to figure out, Lord, Let me hear tell you once again that he's seen. 
seen every tear that's fallen from your eyes. He's heard your cry. He's witnessed your persistence and for your faithfulness. He's getting ready to unleash a power in the inside of you that he's getting ready to give you the authority to go get back everything that the enemy has stolen from you. Somebody, can I tell you that what happened, what happened in our closing, what happened when God gave David the okay, what God did was he released what I like to call divine favor on David. And the last time I checked, favor is not fair. Uh, last time I checked, favor can do for you what no education can do for you. The last time I checked, favor can open doors uh, that no man can open. Favor can elevate you to places that folk are trying to bring you down from. Favor will cause money to run into your pockets. Favor will cause the magnet of blessings to come upon your life. The last time I checked, favor took Esther from a herbal servant to the queen of a nation. Favor took Joseph from the pit to the palace. Favor took Lord, have mercy, for took David from the pit, Lord, to be king of the nation. I came to tell you, God's getting ready to unleash a favor. You ought to tell your neighbor, favor's all around you. Favor.
Ha <laughs> ha! 